So we, we believe that those uh, ultra metal poor stars, they are what we call uh, second generation stars, uh, meaning that they were born out of you know, gas clouds that were pre-enriched by the very first stars to be born in the universe. So I think one of the working models is that uh, the very first stars to be born in the universe, they were just born out of pure hydrogen and helium. And most of those stars, they were really massive, meaning that they evolved really fast. So once they evolved, they created uh, new chemical elements and they enriched the interstellar medium with all of those elements, allowing for the second generation stars to be formed with slightly lower masses. And these are the ones that we are observing. So when we look at the atmosphere at one of those ultra metal poor stars, uh, we believe that we are seeing, um, how can I say this, just the, just the genetic information, if I may say, of the first generation of stars. And this is really important because then we can constrain models of uh, first star nucleosynthesis and the chemical evolution of the universe and how structures form uh, right after the Big Bang.